Hey guys, it's Alex. I'm here to share with you uh, my last project for the month of July as part of the design team for Quick Creations. For this project, my theme was um, birthday and Noelle requested I did a easel card. So she sent me this stamp right here. And then here is my card. Um, she sent me paper also. She sent me some sheets of the um, Echo Park birthday wishes for girl. Um, and so these are the sheets that I used. This, this, this. And they're all double-sided. So here's my easel card. Sorry, it's not the best <laughs> view. But um, here it is. Okay, so for this um, layer right here I used a one of those large dies from um, Spellbinders I don't have the big Spellbinders machine but I, I use like I think it's like the third largest and since this was a six by six page I just you know put it in a way where I could make the most of it so that's why this is flat which in a way I'd like better because it makes it stand nicer um, once you open it and it's set as an easel then I created this layer and I layered it with um, just plain white cardstock then again this layer oh this is raised with foam dots um, then I created this part right here Again, with the paper from the collection, this is watercolored um, with my Tim Holtz Distress Markers. And I layered her, I raised her a little with um, Fun Foam. And then these are some flowers from my stash. These are um, Recollections. This is Wild Orchid Crafts, so are the leaves. Same here, Wild Orchid Crafts, the leaf is Recollections. And then this is part of a stamp from my stash. This one comes with a sentiment, but I thought I'd rather use the just a plain. And then again, this is another sheet. This is the other side for the stripe sheet right here. This is it's like a very tiny chevron. And then I put just some white cardstock for the sentiment, and then a couple of enamel dots. And this is some trim, like a tutu trim from Hobby Lobby, and then pearls. And I think the pearls are also from Hobby Lobby. So that's it. Just like that. Sorry guys. There. And the back is just plain. Um this the size of this the base of this card is not any size, I guess, you know, like any standard size. This is a size that I had to create so that the the cardstock, the base wouldn't peek out from the sides. Because these go deeper. So these are like, see, not as deep. So I had to make these. I don't know. I think it's like a four in five eighths by maybe five and a half. Yeah, so just the width I had to adjust. But then the, the height would be the same. So that's it, you guys. I hope you guys liked it. And thanks for watching.